Hey everybody, this is Joby and uh, today I want to show everybody the Arxand Armory motif style. I just completed it in the Reach and uh, I think it's really good looking style. I didn't buy any of them, I just traded with my guildies and um, just completed it the other day. But before we get started, I'd like to ask everybody to please like this video and subscribe to the channel. Please hit the notification bell so you can get notified whenever I make a video. I make a video every single day, no matter what. I have about 430 videos in my catalog. You can just search within my channel. It's the small magnifying glass right above the video section. I have uh, the videos on almost every subject in ESO. Join me on Discord, the most chill Discord server on the planet. Link in the description. If you're on Xbox One, North American server, add me as a friend, send me a message. If you want, you can join my guild. 256 active members, a lot of nice, helpful people. All right, so let's get started. Um, this is something in journal that is very, very useful. You get it from doing the mage quest, not the books, not the lore books, although you will have to get lore books to level five to complete it. But you can see every single style. Okay, you can see I have a, I know a lot. I know um, probably close to 70 styles. I only don't know like 19 styles in the game. And here it is. Arxan Armory Style, 14 out of 14. Some of them I don't have. You can see Boy and Armager only have four. Those are really hard. And boy, are they ugly. So, there's two ways to look at all the motifs that you have. Well, there's three ways actually, but you can either go to um, your collections, like this, and you go to collections, and then you go down armor and weapon styles. If you go to armor, Let's say you go to the head. You can look at all these. Like this is the hat. Let's see if the preview's working. It was bugging out earlier. Oh, there we go. Sometimes it bugs out. You have to just um, go out. Press B, go out, and then come back in again. Um, you know, you can like look at all these different ones. And it doesn't really matter if you don't, when you're not in the outfit station, if you don't know them. Like I don't know the Sea Giant hat, but I can still preview it even though I don't know it, which I think is great. You can look at the stuff, get a goal going on of what you want to look at. Um, Worm Cult, this is light. Incredibly stupid on an Argonian. What are you going to do? So that's one way to look at it, but I like to use the outfit station because the lighting is a lot better. So if you go to outfit station, go to equipment. Now here's the funny thing. This is what I look like if I don't have my costume my motifs this is my real armor this is a necropotence and a lambrus the sho a lambrus shoulder lambrus helmet and then uh necropotence jerkin and uh all the other accoutrement but i like my dead water style and the way you set up here that helmet is just what i happen to have on but i usually hide my helmet the shoulders are from elsewhere a reward and that's also something i want to talk about is um what's the difference between style pages and motifs so all these all these styles like if i go to if i go here to head uh wait a minute what am i doing there we go okay so all of these that are filled in i can put those on myself to wear them on my costume and I pay the fee or I can also craft armor in these styles because I know the style now these I can't because I, d I can't craft armor and I can't wear it oh but I have to collect those pages now there's something else is called style page and those style pages when you get those you can't craft armor but you can make yourself look like that so I don't know if that's clear or not like um, the sovereign guard uh, would be some of them which I cannot find them I think you have to go down to signature just like Undaunted the only helmet that I own is the blood spawn the opal blood spawn and you can't craft armor like that because it's just an outfit style same thing with all these down here all these signature like the uh, sovereign guard stalwart helmet you can't craft armor like that you can only make your your own characters appear to look like that 
All right, so let's check it out. Let's look at the um, uh, Arkzand Armory motifs. So if we go here, yeah, there it is. That's the hat. Now, see, what I can do is I can press that, and then I can go down to chest, go up here. Should be lots of uh, Argonian. That is the jerkin. And then one more over would be the robe. Okay. Kind of metallic looking. Got some embroidery there. And of course you can color all that. You know, if you don't like that mustardy color, you can change it. That's okay, but I think the medium, let's let's go ahead and, uh, well, I guess we'll just do light forever. I'll put the jerkin on. And then we go down to shoulders. Go up. So be epaulets. Pretty cool. That'll just like make the color match on its own. Sometimes I don't know. Sometimes they do really well, but other times the color coordination isn't that great. These are the gloves. Go down to waist. That's all in uh, heavy. There we go. Yeah. There's a sash. Legs. All the way up. Argonian. Arc sand. There we go. There's the breeches. And the last one will be the sandals. So you can't see my beautiful toenails, which is unfortunate. There's the shoes. All right. So this is all the light stuff. Pretty good. Interesting. What I like is the heavy stuff. I think the heavy looks really nice if we go all the way down. Oh, that's to the weapons. There we go. You know, you got medium. That's going to be the helmet. <laughs> Look at him. He's all mad. All right. So this is the one right here. Pretty good. Helmet. Most people probably would leave that open. Let's go all the way down to... Uh, that's the jack. That's pretty good too. Like a smaller version. But I think this crest looks a lot better. There we go. It's like a robot. Let's go into um, oops. heavy again. These shoulders are very cool. This will be something I'll definitely be doing. Look at those things. Super chunky. That's pretty good. I'll probably put those on my Dragon Knight. Color them gold. Because look how big those things are. That's very good. We go to hands. The gloves are good too. And the heavy, really chunky looking. I always like that kind of uh, metallic look. And also, it takes dye very well. Those gold dyes and stuff look much better. All right. Do a heavy belt. There's the girdle. It's got the like flap hanging down there. That's pretty good. Let's go to legs. Heavy again. If you guys want to look at this, you know, like I'm showing you, if you want to see what what the medium set looks like, you can just open up your collections and then do a little preview right there. If it doesn't work, just back out and go back again. Still doesn't work, just go ahead and go to like a, maybe go to a different area. Because right now I'm in my house and it's a bug. Okay, so we've got arcs. Yeah, here, there it is. Sabatons. I think that looks pretty good if you colored it with some gold or maybe that uh, Ellsworth dye. I mean, it looks pretty good the way it is right now, like a robot with a tail. I'm a robot with a tail. Yeah, I think it looks pretty good though, um, even just like that, you know. And like I said, you guys can check with your collections if you don't want to go to the outfit station or um, you can just come to an outfit station and look you're always welcome to come to my house if you're on xbox one north american server so i do enjoy motifs and uh can craft people armor like this like if i was making somebody an armor set since i have the full book i would be able to craft even a training set like a level 10 or whatever a very low level and then they could look just like this which uh is excellent and then they can dye their own armor uh, as everybody knows if you go over to dyes, you know, you can have 
your costume on like this not costume but your uh, armor and then all you have to do is to press R the right stick and it'll uh, just click it and it'll randomize it now see that looks great right there it's like all silver if I click it again it'll change different colors it just randomizes purple man I'm a grape see that's a gold right there pretty good you know and you don't have to dye it all like that you can dye it and then uh, do separate channels just keep clicking the stick of course this costs money you know look I'm already down to 7700 but you know if you're trying to create something that's uh, unique to you and I haven't seen anybody wearing this because this is a pretty new motif so you know you can make something that's unique to your character which to me is uh, very important because I love the way my character looks people will uh, recognize me you know from the channel when I'm playing the game and come up and that's how we can get more people for the guild which is fantastic all right so that's about it for today I just wanted to show everybody uh, the the way that they can look at the the motifs and also the arc sand armory motifs which I finished out thanks to all my guildies and I hope everybody enjoys it so please give me a like and a subscribe if you enjoyed the content leave a comment in the comment section if there's anything you'd like to see or if you have any problems if I can help you with I'll be glad to help you join me on discord the most chill discord server on the planet there's a link in the description and if you're on Xbox one North American server you can join my guild my guild's name is upper echelon mediocrity and we have drum roll please 255 members with 27 members online and there's always somebody there to help you all right so until that time let's get paid